Because of their composition, comets are often referred to as dirty snowballs. They're made mainly of dust and frozen substances, including water ice and frozen ammonia, carbon dioxide and methane. They also usually have a rocky core. When a comet comes close to the sun, the frozen substances begin to turn into gas and form a wide cloud known as a coma. The sun's radiation pushes dust and gas particles away from the coma and forms a long tail. Comets are very small in size relative to planets. The average diameter of a comet's solid nucleus is usually less than 10 kilometers or 6 miles. But when comets come close to the sun, the coma can reach 80,000 kilometers, 50,000 miles in width, and the tail may stretch out over 1 million kilometers, 600,000 miles in length. Asteroids are the rocky leftovers from the formation of planets in our solar system. They mostly orbit the Sun in the main asteroid belt between Mars and Jupiter. Their sizes range from less than 10 meters to hundreds of kilometers across. They don't have frozen substances like comets, therefore even if an asteroid comes close to the Sun, it doesn't form a coma or a tail. Meteoroids are small, solid objects that move in interplanetary space. Their size ranges from between 30 micrometers and 1 meter in diameter. Mostly they come from the debris of comets and asteroids. Meteors are meteoroids that burn up when they enter the Earth's atmosphere. We often call them shooting stars. If a meteor is extremely bright and explodes in the atmosphere, it's known as a bolide. If a meteor reaches the Earth's surface, it's called a meteorite. Meteorites are rarer than gold and can therefore be very valuable. One gram of a meteorite can be sold for between 50 and a thousand dollars depending on its rarity.